podcast, I'm just going to show a little bit about how to set the um, grading feature for this module as a complete or incomplete. And so it's relatively easy. Again, if you're familiar with Canvas, then there should be no problem. If you're unfamiliar with Canvas, still no problem. Uh, I'll walk you right through it. So uh, this is in a development course that I've created. I've gone ahead and downloaded this uh, first module for the ISTE standards for educators, the learner module that uh, courses have been uh, downloading from the Canvas Commons. This uh, along with this will work in, in any of the modules and so this is just kind of as a, as a demonstration here. The assignment for this module is for the candidates to do several things and to um, share some different work related to their professional learning. And so um, to change some of the settings for this right now, if you download the module from Cam uh, Canvas Commons, it uh, will download something similar to this. And so this is the, uh, the module, the assignment, and then there's a rubric attached to that. And for this rubric, um, you can do some different things, but for right now, uh, I, I set this as 20 points. Um, other people have downloaded it and put different points to it. One of the things we'd like to try and do is to just have it set for complete or incomplete. This gives us a just a point to kind of check to make sure that it was completed. Um, and so it's really easy. If you notice, I clicked on the edit button. Uh, from there, it takes me into the edit fields where I can change things here. And for here, what I can do is uh, I can Again, I can still set points for this assignment. Um, and what I can do is, instead of it being worth points uh, in this display grade as fe uh, field, um, I can move that to complete and complete. And so once I do that, uh, that's really all I need to do. And I hit save. I have to make sure and scroll down to the bottom, hit save. Um, and then uh, it should be set to do that. And the way to, to look at it is go into the grades feature and again this shows as a test student uh, this shows here is that assignment uh, associated with that module and it just has uh, basically a drop down option here is a green check to, that it was complete uh, an X if it's incomplete uh, and then you have some other ungraded or excused options there too but basically this provides you with just those two options there um, and it's still you can still have it again worth be worth points it can be com fully completed successfully or not completed and it's either all points or no points so that's just a real, real quick overview of how to uh, get into those modules and um, put into the grade book that the modules have been completed or not completed have a great day